Hello, so I'm here with the new part of this Skycoast replica series. So this is what we have done in the earlier parts. We have created the label and the landscape with the normal player movement with the camera script. So now I'm going to implement the joystick for mobile controls so go to asset store joystick pack So now first thing we will just import the joystick prefab into our scene. So I'm going to use the fixed joystick. Create a new canvas. Here and put the joystick inside the canvas. Go select the canvas and go to inspector. Set the camera. Now you can see the plastic is on correct position. Okay, now I'm going to add a new script to our plan. So select the plan object and add a new script. Name it player movement. Hold on for a while until the Script is compiling. Okay, so here is our player movement script. So I'm going to create a public float value for speed. And public fixed joystick. Joystick. Okay, then just take the reference from the sticks and find it object of type fixed joystick okay. 
okay now go to update function and check if the joystick horizontal value not equal to zero or joystick vertical value not equal to zero then we will create a moment function here So first we are going to create a vector 3 position is equal to new vector. So here we are going to use the joystick dot horizontal and joystick dot vertical. dot local position dot z like this okay so okay so just do one thing actually we are not going to move it according to the local position so just do like this and keep the y0 and here now we create the moment function so transform or translate goes into speed into time dot delta time and space dot world We are going to check is not working because the speed is 0 keep it 20 then check yeah it just start moving so two thing we need to move on and the canvas should be on 40 and speed should be 20 here yeah. okay so now we need to clamp the movement area for plan so that plan will not go off screen like this or this okay so here we go here and just check what is the x value for minimum and for maximum so i think it is 15 and minus 15 okay just keep it zero and then create here a new function load bound x position dot x and then bound x equal to net function dot clamp we will clamp the value from minus 15 to plus 15 okay then we do same for the y Then I'm going to 
to check for the buy value our plan is going downside like this so we just need to stop the thing transform dot position is equal to transform dot position dot x leave the y for now transform dot position dot chat keep it zero for now and then go to editor and uh, just make the plan independent and this is the value what we want so copy it or not uh, just paste the value here Let's check. Okay, so you can see now our plan is not going downside and everything is working fine. So now we are going to create the function for rotation. So here we just write transform dot local rotation is equal to quantarian dot Euler angle. So here we can see there is already minus 160 degree. So minus 160 degree and then We just multiply the thing like joystick dot horizontal value into minus 45 degrees so that the maximum value will be minus 45 or plus 45 and that should be zero like this but if the joystick value is zero then we will simply copy this line paste it here Now you can 
means your uh, planets start rotating according to the movement now it is looking more awesome for our game okay so this is the another problem means the patch is disabled or the move to the next position so we are going to select the patch prefab here open it and set the collider to only in front side not for the whole patch ok so now that is will be served as you just need to remember that the collider should be on the front side not from the back side you can save the preset save the scene Okay, so everything is looking fine now and everything is also working uh, awesome so hope you like this tutorial and please uh, give the feedback in the comment section and please don't forget to subscribe the channel thank you thank you so much